Well, you know, there's always a Nashville connection, and this one goes back decades as a Music City movie director tells the remarkable story of his former hockey teammate. Eric Lamarck was an NHL and Olympic hockey star, but more incredible than that was his survival story, stranded on top of a snowy mountain for eight days. Renowned film director Scott Waugh brought his project to the big screen, and the movie is called Six Below, Miracle on the Mountain. We are so glad to have you with us on Talk of the Town today. Oh, thank you very much. You're a new Nashville convert. I am. I've been here almost one year today. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. we're glad you're here. Uh, trust me, I've lived in Los Angeles my whole life, so it's actually very exciting being around a place where people are actually nice. Yeah, we are, aren't we? <laughs> yes. <exactly. laughs> okay, so this movie has such a fascinating story, uh, and it goes yeah. back to your childhood. Yeah, it does. They sent me the book. To, they wanted me to turn it into a movie, and they gave me this pitch on it about a crystal meth addict snowboarder that got lost in Mammoth Mountain in 2004, and it's about a survival story, but they didn't tell me his name. So they sent me the book, and on the bottom of the book, it says, The True Story of Eric Lamarck. And I was like, oh my gosh. I went to my assistant. I'm like, hey, did Eric Lamarck play hockey? And they're like, yeah, he played for the Boston Bruins. And I was like, oh my gosh, show me a picture. And they showed me a picture. I'm like, I played hockey with this guy for six years when I was a kid, and his dad was my coach. Wow. So I was like, I have to direct this movie. Yeah. So what was the story about? I mean, it was more than just, um, you know, here's this hockey star stuck on a mountain. Yeah, you know, I mean, look, you really follow the eight days of what really happened to him. It's really, you know, they, they nicknamed him the Miracle Man. Yeah. You know, he should have died on day three, and the maximum was four, and that was below zero temperatures. But for me, I wanted to really flash back and really tell his story, how he got to the mountain. Because mm -hmm. it was really important, his family history and what happened to him. And Mira Servino plays his mom, and she's so amazing in this movie. And it's really because of his mom is the one why he got saved. Yeah, and Josh Hartnett, of course, uh, plays this stellar role. Josh Hartnett, you know, this is really his comeback movie. You know, we all knew him from Pearl Harbor and mm -hmm. Black Hawk Down, Lucky Slevin. He's such an incredible actor, but he walked away for 10 years. Yeah. And, uh, and this is his comeback, and he's, I think it's his best work. Talk about the conditions, trying to shoot when it's, you know, a, a blizzard. Well, look, I mean, when you're making a movie about the blizzard, it's actually good that God gives you that snow and, right. and you shoot in it. So because we didn't really have the finances to create a fake blizzard, mm -hmm. nor I'm not usually known to do anything like that as well, because I'm always doing stuff authentically. But, uh, you know, you shoot in those temperatures and we're there for the 12 hours a day. Right. And we're in warm clothes, sure. you know, so it obviously gave us a peek at what Eric went through. Uh, but he was in spring clothes and he could never leave and he couldn't eat and he couldn't have hot coffee mm. and all that stuff. So yeah. um, it really is a trial and tribulation of what he went through. And it's really a redemption story. Yeah, look, it really is. I, I, you know, I mean, you know, not to give him too much away on the movie, but, you know, he is drug free now. He did meet God on the mountain and, um, and it's really brought him and his mom really close together. And he's he's really a testament to the human spirit. Yeah. You know, and what what are we willing to go through to survive? Mm -hmm. You know, and I think the human nature will push it push itself beyond our own imagination, including, you know, he loses both of his legs and has to eat his own skin to get out. Yikes. And mm. things that we will do, you know, that we never thought we would. But he wanted to survive for his mom. Wow. And it was really important that he didn't die because he didn't want to put her through that. Yeah. Which is an amazing testament to his character. It is a remarkable story. Can't wait to see it. We're so glad you're with us and glad you've moved to Nashville. Oh, I'm staying. I'm here for good. So we'll be good. back a lot. That'll be great. <laughs> we appreciate it. All right. Six Below, uh, The Miracle on the Mountain is out now. We're going to put all the information on our website so you can find out where you can see it. Thanks.